hey guys welcome back to my channel ag motion designs and in today's video we are going to create this melting text animation inside of after effects without using any third party plugin so if you are new to this channel then please consider to subscribe this channel and also hit the bell icon to get more updates so without wasting any more time let's get started So here we are in Adobe After Effects. Let's create a new composition and we are going to name it as, as always, main animation like this. Width is 1920, height is 180, frame rate is 30, duration is 20 second long and background color is black color and simply hit OK. Then go to choose gradient guide option and simply hit on title selection. Then I'm going to select my text tool and I'm going to type my text. I'll choose white color. I'm going to choose poppins black version and then I'm going to type my text melt over here. Then select this text, press Ctrl Alt Home to align that anchor point to the center. Go to the align tab, align it horizontally and then align it vertically. Press S for scaling option and scale it at appropriate size. Now select this text, press P for position. Go to around one second, create one keyframe at over here, zoom in all little bit, go to around 2.15 frames and let's bring this downwards like this. Now select those keyframes and hit F9. Go to the graph editor, select this by holding shift, move this handle over here and this handle over here. So if you see, you will get this kind of animation. Now let's go to the start over here, select this, hit Ctrl D hit U. Let's select those keyframes and uh, again I'm going to hit F9 over here or instead of that simply delete those keyframes over here. Now at this point I want this text should start to animate so I'll select this text and I'll move this over here with the help of open bracket. Create one keyframe at position go to around somewhere over here create another keyframe and go to the start and simply bring this uh, over here. Now select those keyframes and hit F9, go to the graph editor, select this graph by holding shift, move this handle over here and this handle over here. So we will get this kind of animation. Now we need to create mask for this. So first of all, we will select our rectangle selection tool and we will create one rectangle to cover this text and then select this melt text, choose alpha mask to mask this. So if you see, we will get this kind of reveal. So our text animation is done. Now we need to create one map for it. So before that, select this, press Ctrl Shift C and we will call it as text animation like this and hit OK. And let's lock this layer. Press Ctrl Y to create one solid background. Go to the effect and presets panel and search for fractal noise effect and simply double click to apply. Let's increase the contrast a little bit like this uh, and decrease the brightness a little bit. Go to the transform properties, uh, uh, unlink this uniform scaling and increase the height like this and uh, let's decrease the uh, width up to 90% like this and let's make this scale height to 1000 up to this. Now after that I'm going to select my ellipse tool and I'm going to create one ellipse over here. Press Ctrl Alt Home to align their anchor point to the center. Select this and let's move this over here. Go to the effect and presets panel and search for Gaussian blur and simply double click to apply and let's increase the blur in the values to 300. Select this Gaussian blur and hit control sorry uh, select this shape layer hit control D and let's move this over here. Select both of them and move this over here like this okay so here and here okay then select all of these three layers press ctrl shift c and let's call it as map and hit ok and we will hide this after that select this text animation uh, go to the effect and presets panel and search for time displacement effect and simply double click to apply go to the start and we are going to choose this map uh, and now if you hit play it will take a little bit time to load this animation but you will get this kind of effect over here if you want then you can choose quarter resolution to run this animation a little bit faster so my animation is ending at four seconds so i'll hit n over here uh, now select both the layers press ctrl shift c and let's call it as animation over here now select this hit ctrl d two to five times select this fifth layer go to the effect and presets panel and search for fill effect and double click to apply uh, select this fourth layer again apply fill effect choose green color 
select the third layer apply fill effect choose blue color like this select this uh, let's delete this layer we don't need that and now i want them to be animated one by one so let's go hit page down button two times select this move this over here move this over here and move this over here so if you see we will get something like this and let's make this half of resolution select all the fourth layer fourth third and second layer and in the blending mode we are going to choose screen okay so we will get this kind of stuff over here like this so if you see this animation we will get something like this then right click new and create one adjustment layer go to the effect and presets panel and search for glow effect to apply like this increase the glow radius to 60 over here and glow threshold to 100 and glow intensity to 0.5 okay like this so we will get this kind of animation so this is how you can create melting text animation inside of after effects